If you're watching Effort at AM, I broke this pencil in half. I, I, I needed that. It was my pencil. It was kind of, kind of rude. Oh, I'm sorry. Like, I thought... Like, I needed that pen. I don't have any other pencils. No, I thought, like, I was using yours for the thing. Like, I don't have one either. No. We're going to use your pencil. Okay. We'll just do the, do the thing. Just do the thing. This is just good the point. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> that broke a lot easier than I was expecting. So I just, like, did, it, did, it like, did it break before it hit your head? What? Did it break before it hit your head? No, no. Yeah, I don't was... think it broke over my head, but it was like back here because I expected a lot more resistance. So I just went, <clears throat> and it just broke like butter. And I'm like, oof. Attention juniors or seniors. Hack Experience Day is Friday, April 6th. This is a great opportunity to do the following. Discover over 100 plus programs. Don't ask me what they are. Take part in hack chats with faculty. Participate in a mock classroom situation as opposed to a real classroom situation. Learn about taking classes while in high school. Tour the campus with student ambassadors and have lunch on us. First come, first serve. This should be a comment right there. Please stop by guidance and pick up a permission slip. The deadline is Friday, March 23rd. Attention seniors, the Effort and National Bank Scholarships, including the Hibschman Scholarship, are now open. Log on to Naviance Family Connection to complete your applications. Apply today and get free money for college. Applications and all materials are due by March 31st. You've probably noticed some changes, maybe, as we pack up for the Media Center renovation, perhaps. The time has come. All classes, study halls, flex obligation time, NHS passes, etc. will no longer be accepted in the library beginning March 19th. The last day to use the Media Center and its resources for any reason is March 16th. Woohoo! Don't forget that. Thanks for your understanding as we prepare to create a fantastic space for you next year. Now over to Joe with the news. <laughs> Charles Pudemont, former regional president of the Autonomous Community of Catalonia, has announced that he is ending his bid to be elected president of the region. What a shame. He decided to promote the ascendancy of the detailed Catalonian activist Jordi Sanchez instead. This is a particularly interesting decision as it comes after a recent regional snap election in Catalonia in December that saw pro independence parties strengthen their grip on Catalonia's parliament. Although he has been elected to lead the region, he cannot be sworn in as he is in self imposed exile in Belgium and will be arrested if he attempts to return to Barcelona to be inaugurated. <laughs> Today is the birthday of our beloved author and illustrator, Dr. Seuss. Theodore Seuss, guys, was born on this day in 1904. He is most well known for his quirky stories, filled with fun rhymes and new reader vocabulary words that make learning for children fun and easy to read. His first book was To Think I Saw It on Mulberry Street. His first bestseller was The Cat in the Hat. Seuss has, of course, written tons of more stories and has have been adapted for films such as How the Rich Sold Christmas and The Lorax. Seuss has also written Oh the Places You'll Go, a book meant for young adults, and he passed away a year later at the age of 87. He will be missed. But before we head over to the lunch video, there is a last minute change to the lunch menu for today. Instead of the bacon burger, there is a McFrada burger sandwich. Now, I'm going to send more delt with the lunch. Just say that you're an old turtle is the best soccer shoes book. Like, why are you? You can say that, but you're wrong. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you're an old fish. Yeah, you're right. Fish, blue fish. She's wrong. The foot box where it's at. Actually, the butter bath book. Eat. You're an old fish. What is what is Del and Rasmus and Skrillo and Marzok doing in Bischoff's room? Oh, us uh, seeing uh, teachers for lives. Ah. We're taking photos of the year ball together. Can we change the urinal to turtle? Can we change the urinal to turtle to you're the turret? Luché? I'm gonna say that at the very end of the year. <laughs> Attention all athletes that signed up for spring sports. All physicals and research forms are due to the athletic office ASAP. Now back to the main desk. Not only do we have mini fun coming up this week, but next week we have our very first student faculty basketball game. Thursday, March 8th is the date. 
Do you want to see your favorite faculty, such as Dr. Galen, Senior Cerullo, Mr. Kishpaw, and the middle school basketball coaches, Mr. Edmiston, and Mr. Smith attempt to beat the high-flying, bucket-scoring senior basketball players? I know, I guess I do. <laughs> Join me and many of your friends at the mini thon student faculty basketball game on Thursday, March 8th at 7 p.m. to watch the showdown of all time. It is only $5, and all donations go to our mini thon total. Help us crush childhood cancer with your attendance at this incredibly fun event. Again, that's next Thursday, March 8th at 7 p.m. Bring your friends and families. Attention Juniors, part 1678. Millersville University will be hosting a college fair on Thursday, March 15th. This fair attracts approximately 150 different colleges, universities, and trade school representatives. This is a great opportunity for 11th graders to interact with and learn about different colleges. The itinerary includes attending the college, attending the college fair, having lunch at a Millersville dining hall, and <coughs> taking a campus tour. If you are interested in attending, please print out a, permissions, uh, a field trip permission packet from Schoology Space Limited, so don't delay. Join us in fighting to beat childhood cancer by participating in this week's Spirit Week. Show off your style by dressing up according to each day's theme. Today's theme is mini-thon shirts to represent strength. Don't forget, Effort of High School's mini-thon will be held tomorrow, March 3rd, and it's not too late to register. We hope to see you there. I'm not saying that. <laughs> I'm just saying, like, I really think, like, Yertle the Turtle should be shortened to Yert the Turt. Opinions? Uh, if you if you have an opinion on this subject, please tell me in the hallway. You see Maybe me? don't talk to him. No, I please talk to me. Him. Like literally I, anybody. I, 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 I think that's. Uh, I think that's. Oh I, I, really, I just really. I just really need some human interaction. No, please. Okay, that was good. Hey, you're just really need some human interaction. Piece of your watch that we found. That should be a fill. You just have to go on random stuff. I think.